Okay, so I never know how to start my videos. It's really kind of awkward to sit here and just look at the camera and go, oh, oh. <sighs> Anyhow, um, I'm really bored today. It's Tuesday. And I have one appointment tonight. This is my last week working at the salon um, downtown. And then I will be um, working like eight hours a week total, which is ridiculous, but whatever, I'll still make good money. Um, up at a different salon, so I'm looking forward to that. I'm just, I apologize for the mess behind me because I'm so exhausted. I just cannot seem to get myself together at all. Like, it takes all of my effort to even get in the shower. I'm so tired and Oh, see? I'm tired. Um, I'm so tired and, and just run down and I'm, I haven't even done anything except watch baby shows all day and read baby books. Strange how that happens. Um, but anyhow, I'm feeling really good uh, for the most part. I have a little bit of nausea off and on and um, I've had some kind of weird cravings. I mean, they're, they're not weird like yogurt and pickles together or something like that. Um, I've been eating like wheat thins and jelly, which is not exactly good for you, it's, but at least it's sugar-free jelly. Um, <laughs> anyhow, it's kind of weird. Um, but because I have to get in an extra three to five hundred calories, I feel like I'm constantly eating. And I talked to my nutritionist yesterday, and she really pissed me off. I am never going to talk to her again. She's a total bitch. Ugh, she makes me so mad. She was angry at me for being pregnant, even though my surgeons gave me the go-ahead. And she, she basically told me that I have no business being pregnant right now, a year out from surgery, um, and that she wasn't going to give me any advice over the phone. I had to um, come in and see her, which I already have an appointment for July 7th um, to go in and see her and my surgeon, but I, I'm canceling that appointment because I'm not going to deal with her negative ass. I mean, this is something that I've wanted for a long time, 11, almost 11 years. My husband and I have unsuccess tried unsuccessfully to have a baby, and now finally I am pregnant on my own without any fertility treatments and feeling really good and a healthy pregnancy. You know, people get pregnant in three months out, four months out, and have completely normal, fine births and normal children. So she needs to get off her damn high horse. And I basically let her know that I really cannot stand her. So, hmm. Now that I, okay, I'm done with that rant. <laughs> Anyhow. So, yeah, so basically she didn't give me any advice on what vitamins to take or anything. I told her what I already knew. And she's like, yeah, that sounds fine. Oh, okay. Whatever. Um, anyhow. So, I have an ultrasound on Thursday to see my baby. I'm so excited. I cannot wait. Um, I'm getting a little anxious. Because it seems like the days are just going so slow. Oh, my gosh. So, I have like less than 48 hours now because it's at 3 p.m. Central on Thursday. Um, what else? What else? I can't think of anything. I'm really bored. I'm sorry. And I'm tired and my brain just like farts on me. And I can't think of what I was going to say. What was I going to say? Um... I don't know. Anyhow, I think I'm going to go wax my eyebrows now because they're really bushy. Now that I'm looking at the monitor and I can see myself. Holy crap. Yeah, I, I'm going to go wax my eyebrows. <laughs> Anyhow, uh, and I suppose I should get ready for work because, you know, my clients don't want to see me looking like crap. So. I'll talk to you guys on Thursday. I was just bored and decided to make a video. Bye.